Maybe you didn't know about me Boy, I've been changed Been born again and I ain't never been the same You ain't know about that I'm too bad Boy, got saved and I got a new swag Maybe you didn't know about me I'm on a new team Living holy, so fresh, so clean You ain't know about that I'm on a new life Sipping that spirit that'll get you so right You ain't know Maybe about you me. didn't know that I rock Christ in my life Today on Life As I Know It, it is for the lovebirds or as a single person like myself, it is a Valentine's Day meal that you can cook for yourself or you and your spouse. It is a garlic lemon pasta and shrimp or chicken meal with a side drink of millionaire sour. So let's get into it you guys. It is Life As I Know It Cooking With Soul segment here on YouTube. Hey, let's get it started. Yes, like I said in the intro, I'm doing another Cooking with Soul segment. It is a garlic lemon uh, pasta and shrimp. I think that's the title of it. If not, you'll see it on the annotation. But anyway, that's what I'm cooking today. It's fairly, it's fairly easy. It is a butter, pasta, shrimp, uh, extra virgin olive oil, and your seasoning. And that's it. But everything is going to be below, and you can check it out on Pinterest as well. So let's get started. Um, I've already uh, cut off the tail, pulled the tail off of the shrimp. I seasoned them, and I'll show y'all my ingredients in a minute. And I'm going getting ready to get them started. All right, let's go ahead. As you can see here, here are my ingredients so far. Like I said, the butter, the uh, seasoning, that's what I seasoned with the shrimp um, before I, well, after I took the tail off. And here are the shrimps here. I got a couple of them. Uh, mainly, this, this dish is not calling for a certain amount. It's up to you and what you can take and what you can stomach. But there are my shrimps, and um, I've lightly seasoned them with seasonings salt and then I'm going to use do the rest of the seasoning while they're cooking and there are the fettuccine uh, it calls for fettuccine macaroni noodles I believe and I know the Instagram not Instagram but Pinterest picture had spaghetti noodles so you can do that as well but I chose fettuccine because I love fettuccine um, noodles but um I'm going to go ahead and get started. I'm going to put these on some water. Um, so I'll show y'all the next step uh, with the butter and the um uh, about to saute the shrimp for a little bit. All right, be back in a minute. Here I have uh, two tablespoons of butter and two, I mean, three to four tablespoons of uh, extra virgin olive oil. And I'm about to, you know, melt that and coat it. And as soon as it starts foaming, uh, then that's when I'm going to add my seasoning and the shrimp over here. So take a look there. All right, we'll be back in a moment. Okay, y'all, what I've done now after I did the butter and the olive oil, I added uh, some minced garlic in here and they said um, saute it until you can smell it and then you add your, um, your uh, shrimp in here until it's opaque. But my, I bought the shrimp that was already cooked, so um, grill it until your uh, preferred uh, grilling um, taste or whatever and then you... Uh, uh, I'll show you the next step so I'm going to go ahead and grill mine and then I will uh, show y'all the next step and over there I have my uh, fettuccine noodles going uh, as you can see so I'll be back and I'll show you the next step to let y'all know that um, you're supposed to add cayenne pepper in it as well so before you do all of that add cayenne pepper in when you add the uh, shrimp but now after, after it has sauteed, sorry I had to taste a piece of shrimp to make sure it's almost uh, going well. But after you add sauteed your shrimp, transfer it into a plate and then add another two to um, three to four tablespoons of butter, uh, a little bit of lemon juice and um, turn up the heat some to let the uh, sauce reduce a bit and then you're going to combine it together and then voila you're done. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to do that and then I'll I'll let you see that step in just a minute. Uh, here's a tip. Why are you, uh, uh, I'm not left-handed, why are you stirring 
in uh, anything you're cooking make sure you get the bottom of it so to get some of that um that goodness in it that uh the so you can make your roux or your sauce or whatever make sure you get the bottom of it so you can get some of that extra flavor that uh, was previously cooked in this pan if you're cooking on the same pan as you can see I've added my uh, shrimp and the pasta to the pan after um, you know I didn't combine the lemon juice and everything else in it now I'm about to mix it together and I'll show you next thing is plating it and there it is it is a nice plating only mistake I see I made I didn't add enough of shrimp but hey it, it's all good now that dinner has been served you can sit down and enjoy a nice glass of millionaire sour you can do it non-alcoholic or you can add your spirits in your alcohol in if you'd like so check this recipe out right here on life as i know it the cooking with soul segment baby all right you guys as you can tell on the screen of my ingredients some lemon simple simple syrup uh some whiskey i'm gonna use ginger ale for non-alcoholic crushed ice a shot of ginger uh, grenadine excuse me lemon slices and cherry here is my ginger ale that I'm going to be using and uh, my lemon slices and my shot glass for my measuring and my crushed ice and this here is the uh, lemon simple syrup and all it is is lemon juice water and sugar and I'll put that recipe below in the information box for you as well so what I'm going to do now is add two ounces of ginger ale to my uh, container here my cup that has some ice in it uh, I'm gonna add two ounces of ginger ale I'm on that new life sipping that spirit that to get you so right he ain't know about me There's one ounce. And here go another ounce. And now what I'm going to add an, um, two ounces of the lemon simple syrup. And uh, again, like I said, that recipe below is under uh, everything uh, in the information box as well. So um, you can also check these recipes out and everything that I am showing you on my website at the rh3show.com yes they are all on the rh3 show and will be on an upcoming um website that i'm doing as well so i do not have a um a mocktail shaker a cocktail shaker but i have invented my own so as you can see i put another cup over and i'm shaking it mixing it well and making sure everything that i have put in here was is well combined which is only the lemon simple syrup as well as my um ginger ale and if you like i said if you that type of person that want to use alcohol you can do that but I'm just using the ginger ale and now I am going to strain it and uh, pour it in my glass with some ice here and uh, you'll see me do that in a few seconds there we go I'm adding it to my glass and um, um, after that I will be adding the grenadine syrup this grenadine syrup you guys it is nothing more than um, uh, nothing more than cherry juice but um you can buy that in the uh, alcohol section of your grocery or um, Walmart or whatever but I'm using my shot glass that I've had um, that's a whole different story but I'm adding one fourth uh, shot of grenadine syrup to my um, my glass here that I strained my uh, lemon simple syrup as well as my ginger ale and now I'm going to add a few slices of lemon in my glass and that's it you guys that is it and here is my millionaire sour that you can have right after dinner for your Valentine's Day uh, dinner that you're gonna do on Sunday which I hope you've gotten everything if not please go ahead and get it out but thank you guys so much for watching know that I love you for real and please enjoy this Valentine's Day with your loved one and if you're single like I can myself enjoy it with yourself hey you guys before we close out I have some recommendations for you for Valentine's Day decoration and also after dinner 
um, activities. So check out five women that did some DIY projects that I checked out this week, and I highly recommend, including Naturally Yours and also Shay Three One Seven Nine. Uh, IFY including uh, three other ladies and those ladies did some great DIY projects for Valentine's Day so you can check those out under five dollar projects uh, for decorating um, your area your house for Valentine's Day and also after your dinner please go out and uh, get this activity done at home uh, some uh, paint projects one one YouTube channel one vlogging channel that I have recently stumbled upon and I really love dearly that's to uh, become one and that is TJ and Chelsea they did a date night at home after dinner um, they did uh, some uh, the paint and sip wine and sip or whatever doing the painting at home and whatever but anyway check those out check TJ and Chelsea's video out. Everything will be recommended. Everything that I've recommended will be below in the information box. So thank y'all so much for watching. Know that I love you for real and I'll see you next time here on Life As I Know It. I'll talk to y'all soon. Peace.